at the Wearing Vision Institute, we take a holistic approach to your eye care. We're going to analyze digitally every aspect of your eye health, and that starts with the eyelids. Your eyes like a camera. Okay, you've got a lid that protects the lenses. You have two lenses, and then a film of the camera. And so we know, and we've actually performed the research, that if we optimize your eye health, that we can actually help you see better. So we may get very fancy with your refractive cataract procedure, or your laser lens replacements, or your LASIK or other vision correction procedures. But if we haven't addressed the overall eye health, we're selling ourselves short. So again, we actually performed the research and demonstrated that dry eye causes blurry vision. So as a result, our approach has been to optimize your eye health by addressing your dry eye issues before we move on to your vision correction procedures. Why do we do this? Well, number one, we feel that we may get better measurements. Number two, we it's possible you could actually heal better, but we truly believe that you will see better when you're done, and we are perfectionists. We want you to be the very best you can be when we're done and when we've concluded, and that all starts with a healthy eye. So we take steps to, we have a health and wellness program here for dry eye, and this all starts typically with a cleaning of the lids that we do here in the office. It's much like going to the eye spa and, and it actually feels quite good. I actually do this myself to prevent dry eye. And so we'll take about three or four different steps to just really get you as healthy as possible before we move on to your vision correction needs. So as part of your advanced ocular analysis, we want to identify dry eye prior to moving forward with the vision correction procedure. It's interesting, it turns out that most patients that come to us at various stages of their lives actually have some form of dry eye. So in our LASIK population, this is often from a long-term contact lens use situation. So our first aim is to rehabilitate the ocular surface prior to moving on to vision correction. In our cataract age group, or a refractive lens exchange age group, this is also due to birthdays and aging, and often uh, gender. Women tend to get a double doozy because of their hormonal changes. Add contact lens use on top of that, and now we are really trying to rehabilitate chronic dry eye that we've identified coming to our institute prior to moving on with the vision correction.